Bloodstained Curse of the Moon is a Steam video game featuring immortalized charm into a darkness pill of imagination. A past backlog where Castlevania 3 is better and very allowed to be a sequel in some oddly standards. It sets great boss bet out of the creativity, complex design, and how their special moves are just biting red bloody lip greatness. A luscious collection of stages and some are bland, but others are partnered to ship you a bundle of love and passion and art in your flaming bold eyelids. The controls have a major complaint, I know they want to make it like Castlevania on the NES and stick with the bagging body formula, but I have so much trouble which is really challenging me in some Jasperware parts. Get all the sparkly money bags to take your meaningful score on the next vibrant level. I don't believe people I will forget about this game. This is like a memory lane that switches me to play some more and have a whipping sword tipping blast. The music is really organic tuning and marbling upbeat to make you dance a heat storeroom in another flat dimension. I love how they collaborated all the embroidered worlds and mixed it up with different sections and bloodthirsty areas to spice it up with the flavor of Vania mix. Select characters and other nifty features and even make history by completing all the difficulty modes and unlock stage 9, theoretically speaking. I give this game a 9.7 slash 10. Some parts are kinda overused, the controls can be choppy and don't believe anyone say this is easier than Castlevania 3 Dracula's Curse. This game made me rage in some redesigned parts. Love the Burrito Master. Buy it now.